Hello, this is Mr. Tamburini, and welcome to my lesson on reading selections in the Ontario Secondary School Literacy Test. In this lesson, you'll be getting tips for reading, as well as strategies for multiple choice reading questions. First, let's discuss what reading selections are. The reading selections include the following, an information paragraph, a news report, dialogue, a real-life narrative, and a graphic text. These vary in length from a single paragraph to two pages. Our learning goals for, the, for this lesson will be, we will be able to read information paragraphs, news articles, and real-life narratives, dialogues, and graphic text for thorough understanding. We will be able to apply strategies for answering multiple choice questions. Now let's look at some tips for reading. Before reading, read the questions first. This will help you predict what the reading selection is going to be about. Next, skim the selection and then read it closely. As you read, you can underline or highlight important information as you read. As you read, think about what you're reading and ask yourself questions. Try to see what you are reading. Some readers say this is like running a movie or video inside your head. You can also look for links between what you are reading and experiences you have had. If you read a word you don't understand, Here are some things you can do. Look for a root word that you know inside the larger word. Look for prefixes and suffixes. If you still don't understand the word, read to the end of the sentence and look for clues to its meaning. Try reading the sentence before and after to see if you can find meaning from the context. If a long sentence has you confused, reread it and try to put it into your own words. If you are having trouble understanding an idea, either read on until the meaning becomes clearer or stop and reread. Now let's look at some strategies for multiple choice reading questions. Number one, read and reread the questions carefully. Make sure to read all four responses before answering. And then you can reread and rule out any answers that are incorrect. If necessary, reread the, the relevant parts of the selection to choose the best or most correct answer. Finally, record the answer on the student answer sheet as described in the test instructions. Congratulations! Now you are ready for the multiple choice homeroom challenge hosted by myself and Mrs. Reynolds. You will get a reading selection every week until the Ontario Secondary School Literacy Test on March 26th. There will be prizes every week for highest achieving homeroom, 
most improved homeroom, and highest participation within the homeroom. Let the games begin.